Hi guys! I've got my friend Fiona with me today. Now to you guys is Nona Dora. Correct. Yeah, good. <laughs> I'm gonna give her a bit of a makeover. I'm gonna do her face the way I do my face, so she'll look like me but without ginger hair. <laughs> and she'll probably look paler as well, because I'm pale and she's not as pale as me. I don't know what the look's gonna be. I'm just gonna wing it. So we'll, we'll see at the end. It should be okay. <laughs> Well, I'm going to use a brush today instead of um, a beauty sponge because I can't get into the bathroom anyway to wet the sponge because Nathan's having a bath. So I'm just going to pop this on the face. Of course it's cold. It's foundation. <laughs> Probably too much that I'm putting on and all but oh well. That feels gross. What foundation do you usually use? No, yeah. I'm usually quite bougie when it comes to makeup and stuff. Bougie? Yeah, like I have expensive stuff. Oh, noticed. To be fair, ever since I stopped doing Unique, I haven't really bothered. still use a lot of this stuff though, I just probably won't buy it again. It smells weird. This is actually the cheapest stuff that I got, it's Kiko Milano, and that bottle was 14 quid. 14 quid! Yeah. So that was expensive to me. Why does it like a fiver of <laughs> The foundation that I usually use is 30 quid. <laughs> nope. <laughs> I don't even spend that much on shoes. I For some reason, it's always makeup and skincare I always go really bougie with. Always. Oh, look that way. Look how pale you look. Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> <laughs> I look like a ghost. But it's, to be fair, in person it doesn't look that bad. No, it doesn't. But it's the lighting. Do you ever do this? This is like a, a cheaper one. It's Maybelline. Nope. But loads of celebrities use this. Like from around here, anyway. It's like concealer. Look up here. You don't actually need concealer anywhere else, really. Because I usually do all like here and I bring it right down, but you don't really need it. Why? Because your skin's quite good. Here it is! No, you probably use lots of bronzer because <laughs> I know this I know. is pale. It is quite funny how the difference is completely obscene compared to the phone. <laughs> <laughs> and in real life. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of scary. Right, look up. I keep meaning to try and do everything in a different um Routine like I want to try and do eyes first and then do face after yeah, so like if there's any fallout it doesn't ruin everything That's what I usually do put my foundation on Did Then I do it? my eyebrows then I do my eyeliner Then I do my eyeshadow if I put it on Then mascara and then you don't wear a lot of mascara. I've got eyeshadow do you really? No, because it usually just smudges everywhere And I don't have like massive eyes Do you not use eyelid primer? What? <laughs> Clearly not. Yeah. What's that? This is setting powder. So this just sets the foundation in place, basically. Okay. Have you ever used the um? Oh, what's it called? The spray that's meant to keep your face on, your makeup on. Setting spray. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. That's cosplay. <laughs> when I used to do cosplay. Right now I'm using a different setting powder. This is a white matte one. This I put this on top of where concealer is. Okay. Because it keeps it white very, white. very... Why white? Because, well, for me, I need it to be brighter. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people like do the baking stuff with this kind of thing. I'm just thinking baking powder. <laughs> you ever tried baking? No, because I don't know what you have here in a boat. You know what baking is? No. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I'm thinking food baking. Okay, baking is where, when you've done your concealer here, like all up here, which is what I usually do, you put on, it's like um, like this, but it's white, and you plaster it on, and then you leave it to dry a bit, and then you wipe it off after. Okay. Look up. Why? It just makes the concealer and everything stay there, and it mattifies it down. Okay. Yeah, I won't be doing <laughs> Do you contour ever? Nope, don't know how to do it. Okay, well, this is contouring. And you basically look at your face shape. Like with yours, because yours has got more of like a straight thing here, you don't want to do too much of the curving, because mine's round. Yeah. So I do it here, where it sinks in, and I'll kind of dent it in here, so it looks like I've got a thinner skull. Whereas my skull looks like it's already dented. Yeah, so I'm not doing it too much there. And I'm not going to bring it round as much as I would on mine. So when I was doing Unique as well, I used to um, invite people over for makeovers 
just to like print in portfolio because I was gonna go into an actual business to do makeup for people and then uh, lockdown happened as it does ruins everything yeah and then I realized I don't actually have any qualifications to do any of this so I did an online course and I passed it within an hour, nine hours wow and I was like oh, I've got this certificate and I can't even use it now do you want me to contour your nose yeah go on this is a trick to make your nose look smaller blusher blusher do you ever use blusher yeah I'll put it here and here you don't your nose yeah because it looks cute do that I don't know if that's a good face or not. It's a good face. So okay. it's a good face or highlight? No highlight. We get too much. The only thing is my nose. I don't know if mm. it's doing it. I used to get like condensation on it. I don't do condensation. It goes wet for some reason. Because it's cold. Don't rub it. Sorry! That's what I've rose next. No, I'm just following your natural eyebrow shape though. Oh no. Stop staring at me. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I was looking at your eyes. <laughs> don't don't move. <laughs> What's wrong with you? It's because I'm thinking about to do. <gasps> okay. Go. You done? No. Quickly before I think of it. <laughs> Quickly kiss me. Every time you talk, you move my hand. Stop <laughs> it! <laughs> Be funny if Nathan just comes in here. That's what I'm expecting! <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> Ooh, that's a sharp one. I don't know, I'm not gonna use that. Yeah, I'm not gonna say you'll hurt me. No one. No one! No. <sighs> Considering I haven't done makeup in like nearly 18 months on somewhere else. Not that bad. Definitely done worse. Oh, that's pretty. Use that if you want. <laughs> Keep still. Okay, close your eyes. Hey. Well, don't squinch, just stay still. I do have a fan somewhere. Oh, my lips, bro. Your lips what? They look good. <laughs> It looks different, like, on there, I know. compared to actually in person. It's quite cool. I like it. It's pretty. I like it. Dark red lipstick suits you, especially with the darker hair now as well. I did tell you that. <laughs> red always suits me. I'll do it again when I ain't got a big belly bump in the way. Okay. Then maybe we should do gothic look next time. I think I've got black lipstick at home as well. Yeah, bring that with you then next time. The killer. Yeah. <laughs> if you want to catch any videos that Fiona's done, her channel is Nona Dora. I'll put it at the end of the video so you can see. So make sure you subscribe to her, please. Yes. <laughs> and next time she can do what she does to her face to me. Oh, okay. <laughs> Which is nothing like this. It'll taste like two minutes. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you on the next one. Bye! Bye.